three person A, B, C in the room. If a person D joins the room, then the average weight of the person in the persons in the room reduces by X. Now suppose you have three individuals A, B, C, and their average was Y, and then there is this person D coming in because of which the average is reducing by X. So now the average becomes Y by Y minus X for each of the four of these individuals, right? So now you can make a simple equation that uh, you are saying that this is the value of Y. So 3Y was the weight plus the weight of D, which will be the total weight of all four of them. This should be equals to four times of Y minus X, which is the average weight of the four of them. So four times of Y minus X should be equals to 3Y plus D. You will get the value of D, which is the weight of D over here, 4Y minus 3y, which is going to be y minus of 4x. This is the weight of d. Now, instead of d, if e joins the room, if e joins the room, that means now what do we have? a, b, c and e. Then the average weight of the persons in the room increases by 2x. So earlier if the average was y, now it will increase and become y plus 2x as the average of these four of the individuals. So now what are we going to say? We are going to say 3y plus the weight of e. That should be equals to four times of y plus of 2x. So what are you going to get over here? The weight of e is something that you can get in terms of y and x. So 4y minus 3y is going to be y plus of 8x. This is the weight of e. Now, if the weight of E is 12 kgs more than the weight of D, so Y plus 8X, which is the weight of E, and you are subtracting the weight of D from this, which is why we are calling it as the difference to be equals to 12 kgs, then find the value of X. Let's see if this equation gives me the value of X. Y plus 8X minus of Y plus of 4X is equals to 12. Y gets knocked off. You get 12X is equals to 12, x will turn out to be equals to 1. That asked you the value of x, x is 1. Option D, 1 is the answer for this question.